Number 25, Holyfield vs. Tyson. Everyone was hyped up during a rematch of longtime rivals Mike Tyson and Evander Holyfield on June 28, 1997. Tensions rose to unprecedented levels when Tyson unexpectedly bit Holyfield's ear. Tyson was sanctioned with permanent suspension from boxing and his license was indefinitely canceled. Number 24, Yankees vs. Red Sox. There's more to this rivalry than a simple case of baseball competition. The Yankees-Red Sox has featured on-field violence such as Pedro Martinez's judo toss of Don Zimmer. The Yankees have amassed 26 championships from 1918 to 2004 while the Red Sox were struggling to win the title during that period. Number 23, the New Jersey Devils vs. the New York Rangers. These two clubs seem to battle it out for territory all the time. The rivalry began in the 80s when the Devils moved to the metro area from Colorado. It made headlines in 1994 when the Rangers won the Stanley Cup and the Devils won the year after. Number 22, Brazil vs. Argentina. One could argue that the worst manifestation of this rivalry happened in 1946 when a riot broke out during a match. Police were thrown onto the field and fans rushed in. This rivalry is loosely referred to as the Battle of the South Americans. Number 21, Real Madrid vs. Barcelona. Barcelona is an immensely independent Spanish region, making FC Barcelona the poster child of the nation's aspiration. Thus, their rivalry with Spain is understandable. Real Madrid has always been the bastion of superiority in both Spain and world soccer, but FC Barcelona is looking to expand its ever-growing trophy case, fueling the rivalry of these two teams even more. Number 20, Rajon Rondo and Chris Paul. Tensions between these two have been historically quite high, and they've been known to take cheap shots at each other in the media. Number 19, the Canadians vs. the Bruins. The Canadians and Bruins have played against each other more than any other team in the NHL. The rivalry goes back to 1955 when Montreal's Maurice Rocket Richard got arrested by police for fighting with Bruin Hal Laco. Riots ensued in Montreal following the suspension of Richard by the NHL. In 2011, the rivalry reached supreme heights after the game between the two teams when a total of six fights broke out. Number 18, the Houston Astros and the Texas Rangers. Tensions were high when the Astros moved from the National League Central to the American League West, the divisional turf already claimed by the Rangers. Number 17, Manny Pacquiao and Floyd Mayweather Jr. Though these two have yet to meet one another in the ring, their verbal match is unprecedented. On Pacquiao's acceptance of a less than 50% share for a fight, Mayweather said that the act was a bit desperate. Number 16. Marvin Hagler vs. Thomas Hearns On 15th of April, 1985, the world witnessed the war. Undisputed champion Marvin Hagler fought with challenger and world junior middleweight champion Thomas Hearns. The fight was packed with action and drama peppered with back-and-forth exchanges and is dubbed as one of the most epic boxing matches in history. Number 15, the 2006 FA Cup tie. Heated fans threw bottles, stones, insults, and basically anything else they could find after a thrilling FA Cup tie in 2006. Liverpool and Manchester United had this to say about what happened. These people aren't real fans of football. Number 14, Navratilova vs. Everett. Martina Navratilova and Chris Everett owned the world of women's tennis from 1973 to 1988. Both women faced each other 80 times, 60 of which were tournament titles. Number 13, Yarborough vs. Allison. When it comes to NASCAR, nobody could forget the on-track brawl between Bobby Allison and Cale Yarborough in 1979. They were insanely competitive. The two wrecked, stepped out of their cars, and started screaming at each other on the last lap of the Daytona 500. Number 12, the Celtics vs. the Lakers. When you have the Boston Celtics and the LA Lakers playing against each other during the NBA Finals, expect nothing less than an epic battle between these old-time rivals. Cueing Kevin McHale clotheslining Kurt Rambis, Magic and Larry, the balloon game, and so many classic Celtics-Lakers moments. Number 11, Slater vs. Irons. The rise of Andy Irons to become one of surfing's elite was arguably the reason why Kelly Slater changed his retirement plans in 2003. After Irons dominated Slater in his six world championships, both surfing legends became bitter yet remarkable rivals. Number 10. Affirmed vs. Aladar. One could argue that this is one of the most spectacular rivalries in the history of horse racing. Affirmed and Aladar competed against each other 10 times with Affirmed winning 7. Number 9. Ian Thorpe vs. Michael Phelps. 
The world witnessed what many called the race of the century during the 2004 Athens Olympics. Australian swimmer Ian Thorpe went against USA's Michael Phelps. Thorpe collected his fifth gold medal, leaving Phelps in his wake. Number 8. Ali vs. Frazier Muhammad Ali was handed his first career loss by Joe Frazier when Frazier won their fight in 1971. Muhammad came back with a vengeance during their 1974 rematch. The two fought again the following year in Thrilla and Manila. The fight was so intense, Frazier was not allowed by his corner to come out during the 15th round. Number 7. Pete Sampras and Andre Agassi Agassi and Sampras were the tennis giants of the 90s, both holding the world's number one spot during that decade. Sampras held the top spot for 286 weeks, and Agassi stayed at the top for 101 weeks. During the 34 matches they played against each other, the battles were nothing short of epic. Number 6. USA vs. Mexico When two superpowers battle for dominance at the CONCACAF, bad blood will inevitably ensue. That's exactly what happened during a match between Mexico, who scored 23-0-1 on their home field, and the U.S. 7-13-9 on theirs. Number 5. Australia vs. New Zealand Rugby Fueled by cultural similarities in the 1-2 rankings in the International Rugby Board, Australia and New Zealand have shared a mutual athletic content that manifested in the pitch. New Zealand has won 99 of the nation's 146 rugby union matches, and Australia has taken 93 of 125 in rugby league. Number 4. The Packers vs. the Bears Dating back to 1921, this NFC rivalry is the oldest in the NFC North's history. The Packers won the 2011 NFC title game, transporting the team towards the Super Bowl run. Number 3. India vs. Pakistan Cricket Approximately 1 billion people tune in to watch an India-Pakistan match. These two countries have waged three major wars against each other, and the heat translates well into the field of sports, especially during the eight matches when these two teams met each other in the Cricket World Cup. Number 2. Korea vs. Japan Soccer it doesn't matter that Japan's ranked number 30. Sports can sometimes be an outlet that transcends political conflict. Korea may still be a bit bitter of Japan's 35-year occupation of their country. The matches between these countries don't come short of sports heat and drama. Number 1. Manchester United FC vs. Liverpool FC These two teams are widely considered to be the summit of English football. Many refer to this rivalry as the Northwest Derby. Others just put it as sheer madness. No matter what name it goes by, the rivalry between these teams can get pretty intense.